Hello, I'm Glenn you can see 60. This is my 79th Diablo 2 Let's Play video. I've sold all the useless items, restocked my stash, and I am now going to talk to Anya because I have a quest that says I have to do this. You have stopped Nero Fox, but he didn't have the relic. He must have already given it to Bale. Now Bale will not be tested when he reaches Ariat's summit. Okay, so apparently I'm going to Ariat Summit, and yes. Anya will personalize an item for me. She's going to say she won't do it to anything magical, I think. I, I get a feeling she might say that. But, I don't know. Um, I will do it to the gloves, because the gloves are powerful. That's what she was going to do. She was going to name it after me. Well, that's that. That's brilliant. I, I now have gloves named after me. That's... um. Exactly what I was looking for. I've always dreamed of having some gloves named after me. I've also restocked my potions because I was running low after that boss battle. I don't feel like walking through there again. I'm just going to teleport to the Crystal Iron Passage and walk out of here on my own. I'm completely capable of doing this. We're going to test if cold damage is effective on these things. That's a lot of them. Well, I guess I find out the painful way whether it's effective or not. It doesn't appear to be very effective, no. Given that I'm hitting them with what they're made of. Then again, there were quite a lot of them in my defense. Uh-huh. So, Hurricane, not so effective on enemies that are frozen, basically. Okay. Lesson learned, sprinting out of here quickly. Quicker than that. Quicker than that. Uh, no. No, 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 freedom. Damn. Oh, there's a waypoint in here. I remember that much. Um, okay. So I have to go summon a henchman and take things more carefully because apparently I'm not as invincible as I thought I was. Those enemies in that dungeon were just actually quite weak. Oh, uh, he's telling me things. Okay. Okay, that's where I get the quest from, I guess. I now have to go to the Reach Summit, which was the way I was going anyway. I completed all the quests along the way, right? Nope. I have not imbued Knight with magical power. And apparently I haven't checked a lot of the quests. I will go imbue an item with magical power. See if I can imbue the gloves, which is really what I was looking for. I wasn't looking to have them named after me. Who wants to have gloves named after them? It's weird to be back here. Oh, hi there. Imbue. That's better. Oh look, they've been imbued with stuff. Also, their defense is lower. Oh well. At least they're still alright. And they've still got my name in them. Ridiculous. Name it after you. Why would I want it named after me? Right, back to Harrogath. Resummon all things. Really need a button to do that, but okay. Hello. Right then. Fisher actually does more damage, but it doesn't follow me around, so it's not as useful. Oh, resist fire. I'm in, a, I'm in a cave full of enemies that deal cold damage, and they have a resist fire shrine. Well, that's great design there. Well, great random regeneration there, I suppose, but nevertheless, it's great. Oh, look, Ashwind Slayer. He'll burn my mana. Well, I'll just burn you. Never mind his mana, just him. Why is killing them so quickly? Jeez. Lost all my wolves. What killed them? I think I should be able to kill my wolves that quickly. In theory. In practice, it appears something can. 
Right, there's a waypoint around here somewhere. And I'm going to find it. Oh, there's lots of death slashers. They're not cold enemies. Ah, hurricane. Oh, level up. And hurricane. Oh, corpse. Right then, more dexterity. And let's put a point into Armageddon. And find out how powerful Armageddon is. First I need to find some enemies. That I don't mind dying. Presumably. That'll do. Oh, it summons it. On my current location. Okay. So now I have two spells that follow me around. Yep, I will dual boot them as my spells of power. Uh, and what was it that boosted these? Uh, I get extra fire damage for everything, and I get extra seconds for Fisher. And since I put a lot of points into Fisher, that's great. Right then, I will have to determine between levels which one I want to boost. There's my waypoint. What's the next one? Frozen Tundra. So that's up a floor, I believe. Hmm. Don't know which one to use now. I'll use Armageddon for a while, since it's the new one. Celebrate the new shiny skill and all that. I do like that. And it's bound to be more effective on these things than trying to freeze them to death. Given that they already are. Hey. And the damage is actually a little bit higher on these. Oh, and the Armageddon skill. But then again, it did require a tornado to work, so presumably that's why the damage would have to be a bit higher because you can't, in theory, you can't get to level 31 unless you have a skill that boosts um, access to the hurricane skill. Okay, this is good for killing imps. Very good for killing imps. It's sort of mean, but uh, uh, it really it has to be done. It's a kindness, really. I'm putting all these imps out of their misery. And actually being able to kill them is just a novel experience. I'm used to the things running away from me. I'm glad they're still trying to run away from me. They're just a lot less successful right now. Because I can just keep chasing them and stabbing them. joys of leveling up in an RPG to get into a powerful stage where you can kill things again. I missed being able to kill things. And also I'm finally getting my revenge on those little buggers, the imps. I'm carrying a potion to restock myself. Quite convenient really. Ah, no, you're not getting me, I'm just going to spin around in circles. for you. Right, that works well. I've concluded this. It's taken a little while for me to draw this conclusion, but I, I have come to the conclusion that druids are now powerful again. They did have a brief lull, but they now seem to have made up for it with their elemental level 30 spells. Where not even a tower can stand in my way. Barricaded door, that won't stand in my way either. Don't know what poison me. It wasn't pleasant, whatever it was. I know I'm running backwards, but I, I really want vengeance on these imps, so I'm just going to run around and keep killing them all. 
also the crush beasts were never the most friendly things in the world, so they, they can they can share in the in the destruction of the imps or tricksters or whatever the one call them. They're going to die anyway. And the catapult. I will stand over here between the catapult and the tower and slowly kill both of them. This appears to be it. no no it's not a dead end. It's another door. I'm always tricked by those doors. Because they look like dead ends, but they're really not. You can go straight through them. Especially when you have the weapon power to be able to actually smash them. Which now I do. I did not at the time. I'm originally fine. stand here and have them come to me. Like that. Right then. I have been Glenn 60 I am now the druid of wind and pain and suffering. And this has been my 79th Diablo 2. I'll be back soon.